Good evening. Um, my task really is just to enthuse you all to become Beacon Companies, which, uh, which I became about six months ago. Um, corporate responsibility is fun. I was walking down Melancholy Walk, in, um, many of you will know, uh, about three or four years ago. And there was this huge field kitchen and a gang of about 50 or, or 60 people having breakfast on the meadows. It seemed very strange. It was Cummins and um, they had taken the day. Uh, to clear out the mill stream and I walked again there that evening. They were still there. They had supper um, But above all they were all smiling and laughing. They had a great day and the mill stream was Entirely cleared from top to bottom. So it, it reminded me of Really the benefit um, of your company doing doing that sort of thing You could tell they were having a, a great time and they made a difference to the community um, most of us know something uh, about Evergreen, but it's important to remember it fills a gap in provision. Um, there's no funding from the government. 80% of uh, Evergreen's activity is self-funded by Evergreen and, and by, by us, and uh, it's extremely important to, um, to, to, to remember that. Um, and for me, the motivation to, to help with Evergreen is, is, I suppose, a personal one as well. My mum is a paying customer of Evergreen, and it makes a huge difference to her life. Um, I would say at two levels, really. First of all, she can still do things that she couldn't otherwise do. So if she wants to go and get um, audio books from the library, uh, someone from Evergreen will walk her down the high street. So she gets all that interaction with people. And secondly, just um, comradeship during the day. Um, so I can see um, the immense benefit um, that, that it has. Um, I'd like to encourage each of you to be a, to be a beacon. Obviously, my company is, is a small company. Alison talk, talked about coming. So it really doesn't matter if you're a large or a small company. It can, it can make a, a difference. Um, what I think Evergreen is looking for is as much um, a, a barter relationship, if you like, as a, as a financial one. So to give a couple of examples, um, we put some leaflets into the magazine. Warner's uh, printed those leaflets for free, uh, and I think it was Key Publishing that did the design of, the, of those leaflets, uh, and we put them into the magazine. So it didn't really cost anybody anything, but the result was, was, uh, w w w was quite helpful. Um, the, the second motivation for, for me really is, is at the company level, and we've, we've talked about that, Alison talked about it, Peter talked about it, um, is that the way businesses are run is really changing. I, I'm famously a, a numbers person, but this year, for the very first time actually, I, I gave each member of staff a small sum of money to, to um, pursue a, a sort of hobby of their own choice. Uh, and somebody's done ancient civilization, uh, another person uh, bought an exercise bike and reduced his weight by four stone. Um, a whole range of things. And my weekly newsletter, which used to be all about ratios and stuff, is now actually about how people are getting on with their self-development. Um, and I, I do honestly believe that I have a more motivated, uh, committed and, and happy company as a result of that. And being a beacon is one part, if you like, of that pattern within our company of, of helping and, and uh, co contributing to the community. And the other thing to remember about Stanford is um, that famous phrase, degrees of separation. There are only two degrees of separation in Stanford. Uh, I've never ever heard about somebody that I couldn't get to through two other people in the community. And the same is true of our elderly uh, community in Stanford. We're all responsible for them. We all know them indirectly. Um, their grandchildren will be starting to work in our companies. So there's an immediate and direct benefit to us as a company. Um, finally, two, two other tiny things really. First of all, um, helping will give you a PR benefit. Um, Evergreen is very strong in supporting that, uh, the, the, the local media too. Um, and secondly, uh, there's a plan which I think will be great, really, to have a networking event like this every quarter, let's say. Uh, for me, I would find that 
quite refreshing because none of us is trying to sell anything to anybody else. And a lot of networking events, um, you find you have to come up with a strap line and the business cards have to come straight out and stuff. Uh, here we have a very mature group of people who run very successful businesses. And I think we can learn um, a, a lot from each other. So um, I hope you'll ask questions uh, for big and small companies. And I hope you'll find a way um, of becoming beacon companies. Thank you.